Hello everyone and welcome to my 21st video. The sun comes up, it's a new day time. Yes, that's right, the sun is up and uh, you can see the sun is shining now and uh, on those uh, four panels. And today's video will be on a solar system uh, for, you know, an off-grid uh, house, small house or maybe a security outpost like this. Uh, right now, I'm at the uh, gatekeeper's house here at the front of the entrance of the T estate and uh, uh, you know in 2016 actually uh, there was a big uh, power outage over here in this uh, area here the transformer got spoiled and uh, for I think almost a month there was no electricity and you can see this was connected to a grid before but now uh, I've uh, you know made it totally off grid and uh, there's uh, no tension of uh, blackout and also there has a uh, you know a, so to say stable supply of electricity except maybe on really cloudy days uh, the system uh, functions very well now and uh, you can see the load here it has a floodlight a cct camera and some lights dish tv and uh, also mobile charging points also uh, for the cctv we have a separate uh, panel at the back but uh, on a whole uh, mostly these panels are facing this side why we face it this side is now uh, we want to direct the panels towards the sun as much as possible and that means that we want to face it towards the equator as we are in the northern hemisphere this means that we want to face it towards the south so that's why this is mostly south facing right so uh, i think you have uh, seen the uh, system here and the panels these are 150 watt peak and uh, you know uh, he is able to on the lights at night and uh, record and uh, see who's coming also so let me introduce the gatekeeper now mr uh, richester so if richester can please uh, come he's richester yeah so this is richester and uh, he operates the uh, solar system very easy nothing much to do and also he mans the gate by himself also yeah he's also a big fan of salman khan <laughs> <laughs> yeah so let's go inside now and check out uh, how the uh, system works you can see the floodlight the cctv the small light and also the dish tv antenna there right so now we are uh, inside the house in the room and the panels from on top they come like this and then they come to these controllers here so uh, in two panels are paired together to one controller so you have one two and also two batteries and this combines together to come to this inverter uh, this inverter is 900 uh, va and is sufficient uh, to power uh, most of the appliances here um, this is uh, you can see the battery voltage is uh, 12 volts it just went off and uh, you can see the solar also maybe the voltage will come out soon yeah, you can see the PV voltage is 12 volts also. Uh, and uh, these are all from the uh, Sukam company. You can see this is Sukam. The batteries are Sukam and uh, even the inverter is also Sukam. Uh, I think most, most of you who are in the uh, solar industry in India will be aware that Sukam is no longer uh, there. I think it got dissolved in 2018 but even then the components are functioning very well and uh, 2016 to 2022 means six years uh, has been given no problem so far and uh, next question you might have is why not use a combined controller and inverter system the thing is uh, at the time uh, you know these uh, individual controllers were cheaper and uh, was not really readily available also but of course for the cctv system we have a combined uh, solar controller and inverter system so I think you have understood here how the system works. As you can see, it's very simple. And maintenance, maybe just once in a while, you need to pour uh, distilled water like this uh, into the batteries. You just need to check the levels once in a while. Very simple. So let's have a look now at the other system. So you can see here, this is the uh, TV, which uh, the gatekeeper register, he watches sometimes. And also the um, CCTV, controller and uh, inverter is there along with the battery so this is uh, you know slightly this was added later on i think 2020 was added so this is uh, slightly latest and uh, uh, the gatekeeper can easily you know uh, check the work outside and also relax a bit also you can also see the mobile charging points uh, over here 
near his uh, bed only. So it's very convenient for him. Uh, let's have a look outside once more. I think you have uh, seen the entire system, how it works, how uh, the voltage, 12 volts, it's ba charging the battery. They are slightly higher, um, bigger, um, you know, panels also nowadays. In fact, the one the, for the CCTV, I think is 325 uh, watt peak. So as the years go by, I think, uh, you know, the technology is getting more advanced and more matured also. Uh, if any of you are from the defense uh, personnel or maybe from the BSF, you know, I have a slight suggestion to make also. Uh, you can maybe utilize uh, this sort of system for your outpost there in the, you know, in the BSF outpost there as uh, uh, Meghalaya also is uh, bordering with uh, Bangladesh and mainly, mainly it is south facing also. So perhaps uh, this might, uh, you know, be useful for our uh, brave soldiers there also. Uh, with this, I would like to end my video and I hope you like the video. Maybe you can also implement this maybe for, you know, uh, far off off-grid uh, house. Uh, maybe even the Mr. Simon can implement it also for your place and uh, also, you know, for uh, security outposts uh, not connected to the grid. So I hope you like this video. Thank you very much.